Greetings, uh, October 3rd, 2014, Friday afternoon, preceding this Jewish Sabbath, as well as this evening, Kol Nidre, the first evening of Yom Kippur, holiest day of the year. So I happened to come across um, a um, photocopy store calendar I had made reproducing a pencil drawing I'd done of late survivor refugee, Holocaust refugee Alex Schwartz of Vienna, who uh, I knew along with his late wife, who was also a uh, survivor refugee named Trudy uh, in the 1990s in uh, Seattle when I worked at the library branch in the district where they lived called Magnolia. I don't know what happened to the original drawing of this. It's, I have to write Alex's nephew <clears throat> and great nephew live in Vienna and I might have sent them the original drawing of this. Uh, it's very similar in pose almost identical but it is different <clears throat> to this drawing I did the same date they're both dated October 6 1999 which I drew <clears throat> while visiting Alex in Vienna I was on my way to my first teaching trip uh, to Israel this one's uh, titled here Alex Schwartz having a gut angeschlafen at the Vienna Jewish old folks home in his favorite reading and TV chair October 6 99 this one again in India ink. This one was in pencil. Alex passed on a year or two later at age 90 or 91. This is a, this is a photocopy kind of reproduction detail of a section of a um, very large work I did, which is a video of uh, depicting from a photograph he gave me during that visit in Vienna of his first cousin Camille Hahn of Telk or Tels, T-E-L-C, Czechoslovakia. I have to look up and see if that is now in either, if it's in the Slovak Republic or the Czech Republic, one or the other. This is, I don't have the, an original copy of this, so this is a, not the best reproduction of this uh, Magnolia News article where Alex and a, another friend of mine, Brooke Rolston, now a retired minister, had gone to the reception of the Museum of History and Ind Industry exhibit in Seattle. It was uh, dated October 5th, 1994. It was uh, photographs by this Nazi soldier, Heinz Jost, or Jost, and there were seven drawings from my Under the Wings series there. Um, it's Alex on the left, surrounded by Two Real Memories, Holocaust Survivor and Magnolia resident Alex Schwartz tells Brooke Rolston about his wartime experience in Poland. This isn't exactly correct, but reporters, well, they, they can, no, they mix up things. Photos are part of a photography exhibit at the Museum of History and Industry on the Warsaw Ghetto, which includes pen and ink drawings by Magnolia Library clerk Akiva Segan. show continues through November 13th. There are five known Holocaust survivors in the Magnolia and Queen Anne neighborhoods. Photo by Melissa Riesland. So, um, while Alex did not have wartime experience is in Poland, certainly the war and Poland were close to him because uh, his mother uh, was murdered at the Auschwitz-Birkenau uh, death camp complex. So anyway, there you have it, Alex Schwartz in Vienna and a calendar reproduction of a different but similar stance, similar pose, a pencil sketch I had done of him, 1999. There you have it. And Kamil Han, his first cousin, also murdered by the Nazis.